Well, good morning, everyone. <laughs> um, I'm making this video before I go to church. Um, I had a wonderful weekend. Um, I spent the weekend with my sister in uh, Miamisburg. And then I spent the other half with my, I call sisters, sister, faith sister and brother-in-law, uh, Angela and Christian. <laughs> Thank you guys for a, a wonderful weekend. Um, I really needed it. Um, yeah, so um, my sisters um, spoiled me with their early birthday um, treat in Miamisburg. Um, she showed me a couple pictures of vegan food. And I was like, oh, it looks so good. I'm like, I want to go. I want to eat that. And um, it was this marketplace in Miamisburg. Uh, God, I cannot see the print on this stuff. It's so small. It's a marketplace. And I don't, I don't really know what the... Something... God, I hate that, that this writing is so small on this. Because, guys... I can't see it. I have to get my magnifying glass. <laughs> this is crazy. Well, it's a it's a it's a huge marketplace, and they have all kind of food and everything in there. And um, I was just looking around. I am. I can. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is so very small. That's the marketplace there. Um. So anyways, there, I have um, the bean, I tried the bean city salad, which was amazing, and I did take a picture of it, so when I um, post this video, it will be up in in the description. Then I tried the, something with the, um, it's like a, I don't know. Can't even pronounce that salad. I'm sorry, guys, because I, I will butcher something in a minute. Uh, Mediterranean um, vegetables and Southwest um, salad. Then I have a Arabic salad that I tried and another um, marinated uh, salad and then a uh, rice and beans. And then lemon uh, Brussels sprouts. So good. And then they have some um, green beans. And what else was it? Well, it was, quite a, it was quite a few items. So when I was there, you know, I love soul products. So look at this. Oh, a blueberry. I don't think I've ever tried that before. And then... Um, peach I'm hoping that it's so good like they have not let me down and um, the peach mango there so as you guys know um, when a holiday season come around I love eggnog however I have not seen um, a plant-based eggnog or a dairy-free eggnog. So I was just like, how is this going to work? Because, you know, last Christmas, uh, 2023, was my um, last time having dairy, you know, anything. So I've really been trying um, with this vegan journey. And I was just like... Something's got to give. I know that somebody out there makes, you know, these um, products. And I just don't know who. And all of a sudden, I'm just walking in the store and just walking in the store. And then it just hit me like, damn. Ooh. Oh, yes. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This right here is good. Oh. I don't know why this is not... Why is this not a man's fit? Why? Just why? Why? Oh, 90 calories? Come on, come on, come on. 
Oh, come on. Sodium, yeah. Carbs, 15. Okay, I'll take them carbs. Because you know what? I would, I would, I would, I would do that, those extra uh, cardio or working out uh, routines just, just to, you know, hmm. Coconut milk too? Hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, my sister and I both like that one. So, um, needless to say, um, I might have to take a trip or a drive somewhere just to get that again. Um, because. That is, that's going to be a part of my collection. Now, here's another one that um, I don't know anything about, and I do not know if I'm going to be able to get it. And then I did take some pictures um, of some more vegan food that was, um, that was there. Um, so then again... I just want to give a special shout out to my sister because she did buy all this stuff for me as an early um, birthday present. And I am so grateful um, to you, sister, with being with me um, while I'm experiencing this journey, um, as well as you guys probably going to see the video that it's probably not that long um, when we had went to eat um, at, I think it's pronounced at... Uh, Satin's um, Lounge. I think that's that's it. Uh, High Street, downtown Columbus. Um, so yes, I did have a a Reuben there, which I is so delicious, and I will be going back it again and getting that. I'm going to become one of their regular customers. And the uh, the Philly, was it the Philly or the big the Big Daddy something? And then we had the nacho cheese nachos and their um, salt drinks was good too as well. So everything was vegan. There. And then I've been craving donuts. I've been craving donuts for like months now. And just not realizing like, you know, that was one of my treats that I like to have every once in a while. And I was just wondering how that was going to go. And they had donuts there, and I did take pictures of those, and that was delicious. So they will be seeing me again in the future. They will be seeing me, hopefully, in a couple of months. Um, so, yeah. I will be going there again. I will be trying um, different restaurants in Columbus, too, as well, because I'm about that vegan lifestyle. And now, since I know that I can have all these things and not feel guilty about eating them, um, I will be watching like carbs, calories, and how, you know how I'm eating things because eventually I will be getting off Trulicity. I've come to the realization like after getting to 250 pounds, then I will probably I don't know how long I would need Trulicity. So my goal is to maintain a healthy lifestyle now since I'm vegan and it's kind of like gave me a push to keep on wanting to work out to keep balancing myself to hold myself accountable for the things that I'm eating and um, I'm just really excited about this vegan journey I'm, invited, I'm excited about trying new things I'm excited about sharing these things with you guys and maybe you can share some things with me that I'm not aware of that's out there so um I am just really looking forward to just um, having a wonderful experience with this. Um, this whole entire thing has just been mind blowing. I just thought it was going to be more challenging, and you know, in different cities they do offer um, different things, and you know, in Mansfield, it's mm -hmm. at least to my knowledge, there's not. Um, that many options for me but then again I have not did my research so I I think that that's something that I need to do so you know I can represent my hometown and say hey we do have well I can tell you here at Athens Greek restaurant they do have a uh, gyros that is made of falafel I think I'm, I'm pronouncing that right because I only had it one time and that was before I went vegan and actually that was actually really pretty good um, it was delicious. So I might go back and have that again and 
as far as any other restaurants, I do not know as of yet. So, um, you guys can hit me up in the message section and let me know and I can go and try them and make videos about them. Because, I mean, that's my whole goal too. I wish the manager was there at the restaurant while I was at so I can interview them. So, be on the lookout for that too. Because a lot of these places that have um, these products, I do want to sit down and have an, um, an interview with them. And the amazing thing about the restaurant I went to is they started off with a food truck in 2019 and it's, you know, 2024 and oh, that, that food was just so amazing. Like, I just doing a head shake and just saying, mm, 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 the whole entire time I'm eating it because I just couldn't believe everything that I was eating was vegan and I didn't have to feel bad about nothing. So it's just like transitioning, changing your mind, changing your eating habits, is my goals for, you know, 2024 to just maintain healthy and to help promote um, a, a healthy lifestyle. Where, whether that, you know, be if you're still eating meat or you're not eating meat or whatever dietary restrictions that you have. Um, you Don't limit yourself. That's all I'm going to tell you. Do not limit yourself. Don't put... Don't put yourself into a box and say, oh, I can't do this and I can't. You can do anything that you want to. If you put your mind to it, you can do it. So I'm probably going to release a lot of videos today. I'm very excited. I'm just, I feel renewed. I feel refreshed. And I feel excited about what's coming for 2024. So you guys just be on the lookout. Um, until next time, love one another. Take care of one another. And be safe out here in this world. All right.